the components required for this experiment are node mcu board tft 1.8 inch display connecting cable and connecting wires this is the pin diagram of tft lcd display 1.8 inch so let me explain the connections so here the vcc pin we need to connect to 3.3 volt pin in the node mcu board ground pin connect to the ground pin and cs connect to d8 and the reset pin you need to connect to 3.3 volt and AO you need to connect to D4, SD7, SCK to D5, LED pin to again 3.3 volt. Now let's see the circuit diagram. For this program, we need two libraries. The first one is the Adafruit underscore GFX. Go to Google and search for this and click on the first link. So this is the GitHub link for that library. Now click this code button and select download zip. So you will get a zip file. So the next one is the Adafruit ST7735 and ST7789 library. So for that also click this link and then go to repository and again here go to code and again download the zip file once you download it we need to install those libraries for that open arduino ide and then go to sketch and here you can see include library and select add zip library so here you need to select that library and click open and it will automatically add to the libraries folder you can see the libraries folder here. Here you can see Adafruit underscore GFX library as well as ST7735 and ST7789. Now we can upload the program. For that we need to select the board. Go to this drop down. Here the port is selected. Now search for the board node MC 1.0. Select that and click the OK button. Now go to file and select examples. Now scroll down and go to Adafruit ST7735 library and here select graphic test this is an example program which comes with the library here we are using node mcu board so we need to use this pin connection now based on our circuit connection we need to change this pin so this one is 15 this is 0 and this one is 2 let me explain why I modified this pin numbers 215, 0 and 2. As I mentioned in the circuit connection, so the CS pin from the LCD I connected to D8. So this is the pin diagram of the ESP8266 board. So here if you can see the D8 means GPIO 15. So that I gave here the GPIO number 15. And the reset pin I connected to 3.3 volt that's why we gave a 0. And the DC pin that is AO that we connected to uh, D4. So here D4 means GPIO2. So here we mentioned 2. Now click this upload button and upload the program to the NodeMCU board. Now the program is successfully uploaded to the NodeMCU board. 